What's up everyone, Takedown here. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be taste testing my sixth munch pack, my first munch pack of 2019. I did five of these in 2018 and I plan to do five more in 2019. So let's just open it up and see what is inside. Okay, so you guys are going to get the first look of what's inside. Right here, damn. That doesn't look too bad. They look like Cheetos from another country. I'm not sure what the other thing is, but let's just get right into it. Okay, so the first thing we're going to start with is these Cheetos. It does look like Cheetos from another country. I can't tell what language it is in. Uh, the description is Cheetos XXL cheese and barbecue flavor from Israel. And you got the Cheeto guy right here. So it is cheese and barbecue flavor. It looks like it's going to be pretty interesting. Hopefully it is. I don't think I got any snacks from Israel yet. Wow. That is a weird scent. But it smells pretty good. It smells like what it said it's supposed to. They are uh, puffed. As you can see, they are puffed Cheetos, which I don't think says in the description. But either way, hopefully these are pretty good. Let's give it a try. Damn. Munch pack, you guys keep stepping it up. Damn. They taste amazing. It tastes exactly like you would think. Barbecue and cheese flavor. It's just as simple as that. They are delicious. It is amazing coating. You don't get too many in a bag, but that is because they are puffed. Hopefully Cheetos will launch these in Canada. I think that'd be a great idea because they taste amazing. So this is probably going to be ranked pretty high today, but this is the first snack, so anything can happen. Okay, so the next item here is a chocolate brownie, but it is very thin. It's almost like a cookie, so I don't know how much of a brownie consistency it is going to be, but it is from Canada, and it is apparently a waffle chocolate brownie, so it is waffle. I don't know how that's gonna work out. So it does look more like a waffle than it is a brownie. Hopefully it is a brownie consistency, but there is something gooey in it. Never heard of it before, it is Canadian, but let's give it a try and see how it tastes. Wow, that is amazing. That is amazing. Even though it is Canadian, I've never tried it before, but it tastes just like a brownie. It is basically just a chocolate sauce in between, but honestly, I'm going to go in for another bite. Mmm. You guys know I usually rate chips and spicy snacks pretty high. And today is a spicy edition of Munchback. But this brownie is so good. As of right now, it beats out the Cheetos Puffs. I know that's unusual for me, but it is really tasty. So there's actually six items in today's munch pack because this one is super small. I'm not sure how to pronounce it. Uh, Della Rosa Pulparox. Uh, it is chewy tamarid candies filled with spicy chili flavor. So they're spicy candy. Kind of look like yellow M&M's in a way. Let's just open it up and try one. Okay, so it kind of looks like a yellow gumball. All of them are the same yellow. I don't know, it kind of looks like candy coating on the outside. Apparently it is supposed to be fruit inside it in the middle. Let's give it a try here and see what it tastes like. Yeah, there's a spice, oh my god. It's not that it's sour, it's just really bitter. I don't know what this is. It does say it is real fruit inside, so I don't know if it is spicy fruit or it is something spicy that is added to the fruit. But the fruit is very, very bitter. Oh, that is not the greatest thing. You get 10 pieces in here. I don't think I'm gonna be having any more of it. Not the greatest and I'm definitely not a fan of that. So that right now is dead last and it is likely going to stay there. Next stop is a soft croissants, peanut butter and jelly filled. Honestly, because it is from Bulgaria, their pastries are amazing. I got their pastries in munch packs before. 
So this should be very interesting. Let's open it up and give it a try as well. I honestly thought that was going to be really small. I thought it was going to be a small croissant or maybe two small croissants, but it is a full croissant. So peanut butter and jelly filled. This should be amazing. The pastries from Bulgaria are amazing. I've had them before. Let's give it a try here. Hmm. First bite, I don't see any jelly or peanut butter in there, but you do taste some of the peanut butter and jelly, so maybe it is just baked in it, but it does say that it's filled, so I'm going to take another bite and see if there's anything inside. Mmm. see a little bit there. That is amazing. It is a soft and flaky croissant. So the peanut butter and jelly is really creamy. I'm not sure exactly what kind of jelly it is. It doesn't really say anything in there, but it doesn't taste like your regular jam, but it is delicious. I'm honestly not a huge fan of peanut butter or anything like that, but this is pretty good. Next up is Sriracha flavored almonds from the USA. I love almonds. I love Sriracha. Let's see if they go good together. Two almonds right here. There is a coating on it. It looks like it might just be sriracha powder. Let's give it a try here. They're really good. These are amazing. I got a few more here. They're going to be very addictive. I love putting sriracha on pretty much anything. So to me, this is a win-win. Honestly, because this is a spicy addition and these are the spiciest thing that we've gotten today. Honestly, right now, these are going to be taking first place. The Sriracha Almonds right now are in first place. We have one snack left, but I think these ones might be the winner for today. Okay, so we have one snack left. These are strawberry and cream flavored gummies. A huge fan of that, so hopefully they are delicious. Let's give them a try. First look right there, they look pretty good. They smell just like you would imagine. Hopefully, they taste good. They are pretty gummy. Let's give it a try here. Mmm. That's really good. They are a really good gummy. Whenever you first put it in your mouth, it's almost like these strawberry and banana marshmallows that you can get, but it is a gummy, so really delicious. It tastes phenomenal. I'm going to have another one here. These gummies were delicious. They are from Colombia. Honestly, I am a huge fan, but let's see where I'm going to set it. So it does beat out the croissants. I'm going to have to say it does beat out the Cheetos Puffs because I am a fan of Cheetos Puffs, but these are so good. Usually I don't rate gummies so high, but first of all, you get a full bag. The taste is there. They are very good. They're delicious. They are fresh. Usually you get Munch Pack. And whenever you get gummies in it, sometimes they might not be fresh, but these are amazing. Right now, they don't beat out the brownie and they definitely don't beat out the almonds. So right now they get third place. So, so just to recap, the sriracha almonds got first place, the brownie waffle got second place, and the strawberry gummies got third place. Everything in today's munch pack was pretty good. We got six items. There was only one thing which got dead last, which are the Mexican candies. I definitely would not recommend them, but everything else is still pretty good. Still pretty delicious, but the top three are honestly my favorite, maybe even the top four. So like I said, this is my first Munch Pack of 2019. I'm hopefully only going to do five in 2019. That's all I can really afford. So Munch Pack, if you're watching this and you want to send me some more, I would be happy to open them up for my channel and taste them and do a review. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys like this series because I like trying new things. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Please take care. Peace.